I looked up SpongeBob memes and I see a oh. throwing ass. The f is going on, bro? Huh? February 8th, 1996. Tupac is still alive and well until about another seven months. The world's population yeah. hits 5.8 billion people. And Nuts. Bill Clinton is the United States president. A president who never had a single scandal and was always loyal to his hitty's <laughs> wife. Not gonna lie, young Hillary could get it though. Bill Clinton signs in the That's Hillary? loyal to his hitty's yeah. wife. Not gonna lie. I mean... Eh. Hi, young Hillary could get it. Though. Bill Clinton <laughs> signs in the Communications Decency Act, which is meant to regulate corn on the internet and protect minors from harmful content online. This then leads to a fight with the Supreme Court, and a bunch of parts of the law were scrapped due to violating First Amendment rights. So instead, we got a that's nuts. Her 18 years or older button on corn sites, and boom, the Gooner invasion was. Corn is one of those things that and we literally everyone lies. People flock to it online because in the past, the only way you could watch it Magazines. was by everyone watching you walk in a DVD store. Go all <laughs> literally. the way back to the section with large bold letters that said XXX. Then walk out with everyone staring at you with a tape that says Petite Girl Takes King BBC. But the internet made it so you could save yourself from that embarrassment. <laughs> but recently, I've noticed an uptick in the past couple I of I realized years. that, bro, because it's really just magazines, DVDs, and VC, uh, VCRs, bro. That that niggas could had access to back then, bro. Years and especially this year in sexual stuff on platforms. It's like on any platform you go on, no matter whether you choose to or not, you're gonna be flashed with something. And the worst uptick I've seen it on by far TikTok. this year is TikTok. Now TikTok Absolutely. has never been known as being the beacon of family friendliness on the internet. The platform kinda gained notoriety by girls throwing it back on it. But recently it's <laughs> gotten so bad that people are complaining and are mad about it. Now on on TikTok, as of the time I'm recording this, you can quite literally search up anything and your results are going to be A, thirst traps, B, shaking ass, or C, straight up corn. Like, I'm not even joking. No, he's actually not even joking, bro. And that shit pisses me off. Whenever there's a blue, a blue thing on, on a TikTok thing, I've actually stopped clicking on it, bro. Whenever there's like a blue search thing, every time you click on it, you'll probably see the first top left video be of what you were searching for. And then right next to it will be a bitch who is basically naked. Right under it will be a bitch that's shaking her ass. Right next to that one will be another bitch that's basically naked. It's like, bro, I looked up fucking, um, I don't even know, bro. I, I don't even know at this point, bro. I looked up fucking SpongeBob memes and I see a bitch throwing ass. The fuck is going on, bro? I literally searched up anything in the TikTok search bar and got those results. And some literally, people might bro. be like, huh, Tommy, wh why are you complaining? That that sounds pretty zesty to me. Sometimes my I just want to search up a TikTok video and go on with my day. And literally, you can bro. see people complaining about it and saying all the different things they searched, but instead got some top tier gooning material. How did I go from Fortnite <laughs> glitch to this? I was searching for Nissan Sunny 2000. Literally, I bro. searched for pigeons. Like, how does the algorithm even calculate pigeons to ash it? You gotta be one freaked ass because they call them that. Pigeon and everyone's tile. been questioning why TikTok's been like this because the algorithm was not doing this before. Stool now, pigeon. I got a couple of theories, okay? These are my theories. I got these from no one, but I, I just want to bring them up. The first theory I got, I guess, is that the search algorithm is genuinely just broken. I doubt it. I highly doubt it, doubt though, it. because <laughs> it's been like this for a while, and I mean, how many complaints Through does the updates. TikTok mod staff have to get? Of people searching up birds and getting OnlyFans models shaking ass instead before they fix the problem. Like this is by far the number one issue they're dealing with on their app right now. Unless they Absolutely. got people the age of who's running the United States government as staff, they should know by now. The next theory is that the users are exploiting the broken algorithm maliciously. Now this is more of if the first theory is true and people know it on the down low. Because whenever you search something in the TikTok search bar, the algorithm highlights what's in the description of the TikTok and then tries to base the search and related to you like when i searched up the word anything on tiktok some of the tiktoks actually had the word anything in the yeah. description so maybe some of these of models are exploiting this glitch and trying to funnel as many people in their of as possible before it's patched i mean only fans models are basically the homeless beggars of the internet except with mansions and expensive Low cars key. but the thing is some of these are just just regular did a video about sophie rain who maybe insane to make a thirst trap that pop up like some of them don't even have an of they be in a hoe for the love of the 
the game. So that one, it doesn't really make sense to me. And the last theory I've got is the scariest. Cue the scary music. The last theory is that Promoting TikTok it. knows about the problem yeah. and is purposely leaving Promoting it to it. keep people hooked on I the I think app. this might I be mean, the one, think too. think of it for a second. There is no world where these be the one. don't know about the problem. And for TikTok, it's simple. The app is already the most brain-numbing and low-attention span cis-pit known to man. Your dopamine receptors are already cooked after being like, but combine that on top of constantly scrolling and scrolling and looking at corn material and you're never leaving that app. They I was just about to say they want you they, they want you to stay on the app as long as possible. That is literally the 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 um that is literally the, the goal of every single type of entertainment app or streaming service. They want to keep you on the platform as long as possible benefit because the longer you're on it equals more time to give you ads and more time to push you trash on tic tac shop it's also scary to know that TikTok has 25 percent of its user base between the ages of 10 to 19 but let's be real who the f is in line about their age if they're under 18 so exactly. let's just say realistically 35 to 40 percent of TikTok's user base is under the age of 18 all potentially obtaining bro, it's the same thing with only fans bro this is what they were trying to explain this is what they were talking about in the in sophie rain bro is that all most of her fucking uh now there are adults that are gooning for her which is crazy because she don't even she just posts pictures from what i've heard um but most of the people who subscribe to her only fans are kids bro lying about their age in chronic corn addictions like chaos emeralds because tiktok wants to make a quick buck and it's hard to say they're not targeting kids when you search up more kid-friendly things like spider-man something a kid would probably search up on tiktok to see their and then cool see favorite Damn. hero and the first results are girls shaking like bro that's nuts think about it tiktok that's nuts you know what you know what age i was when i first learned about spider-man five imagine i'm on tiktok lied about my age saying i was 13 and i was like seven eight years old looked up spider-man and saw this shit ass in spider-man suits but even worse when you search up coco melon yes coco melon a show meant for literal toddlers or so i'm told it might be a cia experiment i kid you not i got videos of girls shaking their tatas out as a result shouldn't using a hashtag like coco melon automatically filter it to kid only stuff and the thing is with tiktok it's not like this has happened once or twice on their platform it there's been every time. multiple times where people have posted full nude corn under sounds and no matter how many reports they get they still take days to fix it like they gotta start getting held accountable at some point and that shit is crazy because they'll post like basically like like corn for real and then i'll post a tiktok and that shit will get banned for sexual activity because a, a bitch was wearing a fucking bikini on a reaction video i was doing this company's Insane. worth between 80 to 100 billion. How is any of this sliding? In fact, TikTok is so well known for this. They had this infamous day now known as the December 22nd incident in 2022, where every single person, and I mean every, was getting corn slideshows all on their TikTok. And I exclusively remember this because some of y'all freak ass tagged me in some of the posts thinking i was gonna I save it know. for future use and it took them until december 25th to take down all the posts three days to take wow. down all the posts of an 80 to 100 billion dollar company so at this point i'm not giving any leeway to tiktok either they fix this or eventually someone's gonna sue i mean the ceo is it. probably a horny ass nigga himself bro if we're being honest bro i mean he probably is a, is a horny ass nigga himself think about it think about it the Twitch CEO is a gooner too. Not gonna look pretty. While talking about TikTok's weird allegations, don't we take me out, T. Don't take me out, T. Now, YouTube. Uh, <laughs> Twitch CEO, you know, I'm, I'm just, just joking, the messenger, bro. man. Please, I, I love posting on your platform. But this <laughs> has to be stopped. I mean, when is YouTube not having an issue with YouTube Kids? YouTube Kids needs a whole billion dollar mod team to manage it because this been having problems since 2016 but recently i watched this video about how bad minecraft kids content is right now and then no makes elsa gate look like a light work i definitely oh recommend checking his video breakdown because i can't go fully into depth but one main thing he covered and you guys can all test this right now at home if you simply type in minecraft animation for example oh, no. something a little kid will probably be excited to look at on youtube kids oh you gosh. get youtube shorts like steve i'm stuck evolution of skeleton 
skeleton too. I probably gotta blur it out, but yes, the Minecraft skeleton is humping Steve. Steve's gotta get Alex unstuck again? Like, once again, what shouldn't the there already fuck? be some filter to automatically get rid of this? The fact that I've never even watched content like that and the algorithm is automatically recommending me it is weird. The weirdos that post this stuff are also getting smarter too. Because now, instead of it being kid characters and trying to sneak them in doing adult acts, they now disguise themselves as famous kids Minecraft YouTubers so the algorithm doesn't detect it. Because YouTube thinks that these channels impersonating the YouTuber are maybe their second or third channel so they don't care. They can literally, and I mean literally, get away with anything posted on them. And the kid isn't gonna wow. know the difference between the real or fake version. Nope. It's a stupid so they'll watch the videos regardless with all these weird sexual themes. Caleb Jesus. is salty gave examples like violence. Yes, these are all real thumbnails that were posted by the way fully monetized. Nudity. S oh my gosh. A. Mutilation. Grape. There's no world where a kid even needs to be knowing what these things are. And some of the pages even have a link to a Patreon where you can see the characters nude. <sighs> Uh, oh man, I'm, wow, I'm just so dog. Kids. What's Twitch been up to? Twitch actually, out of all the platforms, has kind of improved. Yes, it does still it have your occasional hot tub stream, but now they at least blur out the stream thumbnail before you click yeah. it so you can make a decision if you truly want to go through with it. And most people do. Hey, I said they improved, hey. not that they're perfect. And Twitter <laughs> is... Yeah, nothing changed about Twitter. Twitter still is Twitter. Still about the same level as usual. So yeah, That's where you find I think the, the lesson weeks. for today is to, you know, make sure your little cousins, sister, brothers, or whatever not that I know. are watching Yo, the right things on these platforms. Don't even do that. Don't even do that. Not that I know. Some type of psychological I just know niggas do, do, do know. From. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. As always, I love you guys consensually. And until next time, I'm out. It's getting scary spooky out here, bro.